Hey guys, this is Just Logic. I welcome you guys on my channel. Uh, in this video, we will be covering uh, the update, which is the Plan Tool option, which has been added uh, on the iPad version of the Adobe Illustrator. So, as you guys can see, I have already opened the Adobe Illustrator uh, on my iPad. Uh, so, without further ado, let's get started. So guys, first of all, uh, let's create a new document, uh, like click on this create new option. And um, I will go with this preset, so nothing fancy, let's create that file. So guys, as you can see, we are inside the workspace and now we will uh, start drawing uh, a simple square. Like that. And uh, let's color it with something maybe darker, like that. So we have created a simple square with a random color. So now the next shape will be a circle. So create a circle right here. And now uh, color this circle with something in lighter tone. Like for example, something lighter like that, okay? And um, one more thing, we will Disable the stroke for both of these shapes. So now as we want to use the blend tool option, we need to select both these shapes. So tap on the small circle and select both these shapes like that. So now uh, on the right side, uh, you will see the repeat option and in the repeat option there is a blend tool just tap on that and you can see a fine gradient of multiple steps of this blend tool has been added in the workspace so you can control these steps that are being added um, for now you only see a gradient uh, shape but uh, if you select on this on the right side of the shape you can see if you can drag that down you can see multiple steps like this is one and you keep on dragging upside and the steps are adding one after the other so like this so guys, there's another option. Uh, you can tap any of these anchor points uh, like that and drag it. Uh, so you can see um, the shape is now changing. One point is fixed and the other one is moving. So same thing will be done uh, with the other anchor point uh, like that and tap on this. And here you go. You can change it as per your need. You can also change the size uh, of this uh, shape overall um, like that so guys as you can see this is a very useful option and you guys can use it with the uh, pencil tool and also with the paint brush so guys that's it for today follow me on Instagram links are in the description make sure you subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next one okay.